Ah uh, ah. Uh. Okay. So the Krispy Kreme story. A story from a dear old friend of mine. This friend of mine had to do a group work back in the old days. <laughs> They were a group of five and it was work that they had to do overnight. So, one of the group members offered his house as a place to stay. My friend was a responsible person and so was another one. The two of them ended up doing the project. The other three, however, they ended up eating and partying and drinking. The owner of the house fell asleep first, all snugly in his bed. The other two were drunk as fuck. They were wild and eventually they seemed to be simply drunk. So they went to the room of the sleeping person. My friend was wondering as to why they were in the room and why they weren't helping out. He went a little bit closer to see the happenings and he was shocked just uh, at the dreaded sight. Lo and behold, the two that were drunk we're giving the sleeping person what the uh, English-speaking people would say as, you know, giving him a facial. Horrified by the sight, my friend went back to <laughs> went back to the workplace and tried to erase the memory overnight as he worked, but unfortunately. The next day came and he still remembered. One by one, the people woke up. The two people that were not drunk and were responsible in doing their work clearly remembered what happened. The three that were partying, however, did not remember a single thing. So, the person who was sleeping felt something on his head, rubbed against it. Huh. In Tagalog, he said, Ano tong nasa mukha ko? What is this thing on my face? This flaky thing. This dry flaky thing. My friend, knowing what he witnessed the day, the, rather the night before, did not want to tell the truth. Um, so he immediately tried to think of a solution. Look left, look right, look, scan the area, and then, oh, what's that? A trash can with Krispy Kreme. So he thought of an idea, and so he said, Ah! You guys were partying hard last night and you were playing with your food. You don't remember? Look, there's Krispy Kreme there. That's Krispy Kreme on your face. And the sleeping person accepted that as the answer. The two people who were... <laughs> the two people who were aware of the situation swore to each other that they will bring this to their grave. At, and at least never tell the people who were involved. And that is the Forbidden Krispy Kreme story, which you will all now bring to your grave along with me. Thank you, friend, for telling me the story. And fuck you, this has been haunting me for the past years. I still remember the damn story. <laughs> Krispy Kreme will forever be ruined for me. You're welcome. It ruined Krispy Kreme for me too, man. He ruined Krispy Kreme for me too. Don't worry. So...